Welcome to the Road Safety Authority series of videos explaining the new safety standards for agricultural vehicles which will be in place from the 1st of January 2016. This video will cover the revised requirements in relation to braking. Agricultural vehicles, especially those that can travel at speeds over 40 km per hour, must be fitted with safe and efficient braking systems to reduce road safety risks. Trailers must be the right size and weight for the vehicle drawing them and they should be able to cope with the speed of the towing vehicle. The trailers must also be well maintained so they don't cause braking problems for the towing vehicle. Agricultural vehicles towing trailers can jackknife if the braking system is worn or fails completely. In order to address these issues, revised braking requirements will apply to all new and existing agricultural tractors and their trailers from the 1st of January 2016. The term agricultural trailer refers to trailers drawn behind agricultural tractors that are being used for agricultural, fisheries, forestry or horticultural purposes. The term also refers to interchangeable towed equipment that can carry three or more times its own unladen weight as specified by the manufacturer. Therefore, the revised braking requirements will apply to more than just trailers. They will also apply to equipment such as slurry tankers, fertilizer or manure spreaders, grain chaser bins, silage wagons and more. For example, a slurry tanker with a maximum laden weight of 20 tonnes and an unladen weight of 6 tonnes must comply with the revised braking requirements because its maximum laden weight, as specified by the manufacturer, is more than three times its unladen weight. Agricultural tractors already in use will most likely comply with the requirements if their braking systems have been properly maintained. Here's a summary of the minimum braking performance requirement for tractors. You will see that braking efficiency is expressed as a percentage. The percentage represents the amount of braking force needed to safely slow or stop a vehicle in relation to its design gross vehicle weight, that's DGVW, and its maximum design speed. These braking efficiencies will apply to both new and existing agricultural tractors from the 1st of January 2016. Agricultural trailers already in use might need to be altered to meet the new requirements, particularly if they are to be drawn at speeds of over 40 km per hour. Here is a summary of the minimum braking performance requirements for trailers. The figure quoted for the service brake performance is based on the weight transmitted to the road surface by the trailer axle. The breakaway, that is the automatic brake if the trailer becomes detached while moving, and parking brake performances are based on the design gross vehicle weight of the trailer. These will apply from the 1st of January 2016. The revised standards also require that all new agricultural trailers that are manufactured from the 1st of January 2016 and are capable of being towed at speeds over 40 km per hour must be equipped with pneumatic air braking systems incorporating load sensing to match the brake effort with the load being carried and apply an appropriate braking force, a breakaway brake to automatically stop the trailer if it becomes detached while moving. Trailers which are manufactured from the 1st of January 2016 that can be towed at speeds over 60 km per hour must also be equipped with anti-lock braking systems or ABS. However, agricultural trailers manufactured before the 1st of January 2016 that are not designed to be drawn at a speed of more than 40 km per hour may be fitted with a secondary coupling device, for example the chain or wire rope instead. Agricultural trailers and interchangeable towed equipment manufactured before the 1st of January 2016 that are designed to be drawn at speeds over 40 km per hour and which are not fitted with a breakaway brake have until the 1st of January 2016 to comply with the revised standards. If overrun braking systems are fitted to low speed custom made agricultural trailers or pieces of interchangeable towed equipment with a design gross vehicle weight not exceeding 5 tonnes, they must have a braking efficiency of a minimum of 49% for the service brake and 16% for the parking brake. These figures are based on the design gross vehicle weight of the vehicle. If you are unsure if your vehicles comply with these revised braking standards, contact the vehicle manufacturer or authorised distributor for advice. 
If the original manufacturer is unknown or no longer in business, seek advice from a recognized manufacturer of similar equipment. For more information, visit rsa.ie.